so yeah, I, I've been spending uh, quite a bit of time on the road in the last couple weeks, uh, getting into tour season, getting out in the field uh, with the dealer partners, and and uh, it's been good. I've had a good chance to get a bit of a crop report from uh, from the half ton at least, and getting out into the fields. You know, from my perspective across Western Canada in general, uh, things are looking pretty good. Uh, most of the, the regions are, are teed up for a, a pretty good harvest. Um, there is some variability and you can see it uh, with some of the, the isolated thunderstorms that we've had this summer and there's been a lot of them, too many to keep track of. You can see it even within regions, variability from field to field depending on when those storms came through. Um, so there's some local variability, but in general, uh, the crops look pretty good right from, um, you know, southern Manitoba up to northern Alberta. I was in Manitoba yesterday, um, being the 24th of July. Combines are starting to get into the, into the fields on winter wheat, and uh, that's very positive considering some of those growers didn't have much to, to harvest last year. Um, so they're very happy. Early yield reports um, in the winter wheat are, are very good for both yield and quality. Fusarium uh, seems, to be, uh, seems to be good so far, albeit very early. So um, yeah, early reports look good. Looking forward to uh, uh, a good harvest across most of Western Canada this year.